This is what we teach here night after night. Now you can test it. What would the feeling be like if it were true that I am now the man that I would like to be? What would the feeling be like? Catch the mood. For the mood determines the fortunes of people rather than the fortunes determine the mood. Man puts it just the opposite. If I had a million, he said, oh, I would feel so good. Now, feel as you would if you had it. Catch the mood. And the mood will create that objective hope, if that is your hope. What would the feeling be like if you are now the person you want to be? Well, catch that mood. And wear that mood as you would a suit of clothes. And that mood will actually create an objective state that reflects that mood. Be still and know that I am God. A man will not believe it. And yet he has evidence morning, noon and night that his own wonderful creative power, which is his own wonderful human imagination, is producing the phenomena of life. Now, do not let your reason and your senses dictate what is possible. All things are possible to God. So sustain for a moment your reason. Sustain the senses that are dictating what you must accept, for they're demanding of you, accept the facts of life. All right? If you could accept the facts of life and let reason dictate it, you'll never go beyond where you are. So suspend them just for a moment and try this technique. What would the feeling be like? How would I feel if it were true that I am already the man that I would like to be? And if I am, how would I see my friends and how would they see me? It's all within us. So let my wonderful human imagination see them as they would have to see me if it were true. Bring them into my mind's eye and let them see me. And let them talk to me. And let them congratulate me on my good fortune. And don't duck. Accept the congratulations of your friends. If they really mean it. Actually play the part all within yourself. And then believe it 100%. 